surface of your mind and on the surface of your life, like waves that pass, <laughs> come and go. And so if you see a wave that is a bit challenging, that crashes you on the reef, you can identify yourself with that experience and say, this is mine, I'm going to hold it, I'm going to hold to that trauma. Or you can just open the space and let it go and release, okay? So, uh, again, this is diverging a little bit, but to give you a little bit the, the, the context, because I think it's really important to understand the dynamics. Again, the goal, the ultimate goal that we're trying to achieve here is energetic and emotional mastery. That's it. We want to be masters of our emotions, masters of our shadows. Right? Whatever is out there, we want to be able to navigate life from a place of mastery and mastering our minds and our emotions is an essential part of our life mastery. So that's it for this quick overview. Uh, there is much more to say about that. Of course, uh, emotional mastery is a vast topic and I will give you different techniques and different ways of approaching in another video for now. Remember two uh, fundamental you know, parallel pathways of mastering your emotional states and uh, releasing triggers or doing energetic and emotional release. The first one is the soft approach, allowing diving into them, allowing